sit back, relax, grab a drink because today I'm gonna show you some really cute stuff from Walmart. It's actually been a while since I went to Walmart for myself and shopped because the last time that I actually did a Walmart video, I had Jeff pick me out stuff, which was so super fun, but I was actually really fun this time to go and check it out for myself too to see what they had. So if you love styling, if you love fashion, please consider subscribing. Without further ado, let's jump into the try-on. So the first look I decided to try were these wide leg pants. I've actually had a few requests for me to try wide leg. So when I saw these, I was like, let me go ahead and try them. I really like this olive green color that it was really pretty it has a nice stretchy waistband and it has a little bit of that paper bag waist I didn't love the pants on me I just am not a huge fan of the wide leg pant on me personally I do think it is super cute though I love the look I can very much appreciate the look I tried in a 3x they were $17.97 and 100% rayon and they have pockets which is always good so overall they're very comfortable to pull out the green from the pant I found this cute little tank top actually in the pajama section and in the cactus it has that same shade of olive green and I just thought this was cute <laughs> this is how I roll I love it and the colors are just super cute I love the leopard and the cute little flamingo it's just an adorable tank top this does run small it's technically a 3x but it's like a 22 24 whereas the pants was a 24 26 so it is more fitted on me and it's only five dollars though so you can get this whole outfit for under 25 dollars that is a really good price i decided to just kind of go ahead and make it a fun and playful look and added the leopard print headband my fun heart sunglasses and also keeping it casual but still cute i did my rose gold birkenstock so i thought this whole look was really fun easy breezy but you still look really cute really pulled together but you're very comfortable now while I was in the pajama section I always have to look in the pajama section I don't have that many pairs but I don't know why I'm a sucker for soft pajamas so when I saw they had tons and tons of these soft pajamas there was like mix and match bottoms there was tons of tops and tons of shorts and pants like jogger style pants even you'll see the top and why there's a little lightning bolt and <laughs> as you guys are seeing I just think they're so soft so comfortable they're fleece line they're a 3x and a 2224 but i thought they fit perfectly they were comfortable in the waist comfortable in the butt and the legs there was actually a little bit of room in the leg but that's kind of like what you want for a comfort short right these are only eight dollars and 46 cents which is not bad for a short they are 61 percent rayon 36 percent polyester and three percent spanish so it has a nice little stretch to it as you guys were seeing, I saw this Harry Potter um, sweater. I just had to try it. It looks really cute with the shorts. Just a very comfortable, casual lounging outfit. It's so long in the back. You could wear it as a pajama shirt, which I really loved. And I just love that it has the block coloring through it. I would wear this, honestly, with jeans as well. It was $14.97, which isn't bad for, like, especially it being Harry Potter. It's a 3X, 62% rayon, 3% polyester, and 5% spanish. So it's very soft and has a nice stretch to it. I don't know. I just thought the colors were fun, but what really got me was the same that says I don't go looking for trouble trouble usually finds me I just thought that was funny and cute so overall this whole pajama look is me since I figured those shorts were going to be amazing I had to get this other color I love this blue it's just kind of like a basically it's like a pastel rainbow um, same price and same size and I just actually put it with this tie-dye shirt that I already had and actually I thought they looked perfect together like this was just like a comfortable lounging outfit or even if you're gonna go run a couple quick errands like whatever you're still super cute and you are very comfortable as well next thing that caught my eye was this beautiful floral baby doll hem shirt I just thought it was so cute the colors are just stunning they have some neons in here you just want to be on a tropical vacation in this top I'm in a 5x it's very roomy very flowy i absolutely love it it's so comfortable and it's 14 dollars 88 95 percent rayon and five percent spanish so it has a nice stretch to it as well i just thought it was super fun and as you see i just wore it in a more casual way with some pink slides which i think was a really cute um just you know throw on and go the capris you're seeing are actually also from walmart these ones i tried in size 24 which i couldn't quite button i am a 26 though but unfortunately they didn't have a 26 and i really wanted to try these they are $17.97, 1% elastane, 23% polyester, and 76% cotton. So they are soft um, and everything just didn't fit comfortably. And even if I could have sized 
to my regular size 26 I think it wouldn't have been my favorite anyways because as you can see in the bottom um, the cuff wasn't very fitted to my leg and had I sized up I think it would have been even bigger and I don't like when like I said before too wide of legs on me personally but I still feel like they're cute and they have just those fun little details that you would see at more expensive places you're in a much more affordable price so I do love that as well and then the more dressy way you guys are seeing I'm just wearing it with my black denim distressed skirt I just kind of tied it to the side just to kind of give it a little bit more of a tailored look and then of course since there was neon I had to wear my neon shoes because like hello any excuse to wear those neon shoes I will wear them I love them so with a shirt like that you can obviously mix it from day to night you could do bike shorts with it it's just a very comfortable shirt like honestly even just lounging around the house it's just like comfortable and flowy the next item I decided to try was this dress I thought it was really cute it's 95% rayon 5% spandex and I tried it in a 5x $12.96 which is a really good price also for a dress I just thought the pattern was kind of fun it's like a diamond shape here also I thought was cute and more unique was the sleeve and how it has this tie up right here just gives it a little something extra a little more elevation to your outfit which we love and it has pockets which is always good just you know you can throw a little something in there <laughs> my whole hand can fit in there so it's decently sized as well to kind of just add pops of colors to this blank canvas I decided to play around with my really fun hot pink shoes and my yellow belt and then I had this headband that had pink and yellow in it and black and white so I just thought why not pop that with maybe you're gonna go around shopping and just run some errands whatever you look really fashionable really cute but you're still so comfortable and for the hot weather honestly having a headband sometimes to hold your hair back like sometimes it's all you really want in this world <laughs> So the next top I tried was a two for top, which I usually don't love because I feel like a lot of times one of the pieces just doesn't fit right. Well, I decided to go ahead and give it a try though because I really, really love colors on this vest and I just thought the fabric was so super cute. It's 3X and $16.97, which is really good considering getting a vest and a t-shirt. The actual vest is 100% polyester and the t-shirt is 95% polyester, 5% spandex. The t-shirt was surprisingly long enough. Like most of the time that's the problem with shirts like these. I feel like they're always really short and tight. This was not either of those things. It was fitted and long, like hello. And I thought it was cute because it had a little slit in the sleeve, which I just think is really cute. Gives it a little something extra. This green is gorgeous. I would honestly wear the t-shirt just by itself even. But as you can see, I loved it with the denim skirt. And then I decided to pull out the pink from the vest and just do the pink little shoes, which I think is a really cute outfit. This is a little more dressy look, as you can see, but I still feel like you can just wear it to Costco. <laughs> the price and the comfort and the cuteness I would say this was very well worth it and then I wanted to show you a little more casual way so I decided just to pop on these really cute jean shorts that I tried from them they are the Bermuda lengths I tried them in a size 26 and they're $15.97 69 percent cotton 25 percent polyester and three percent rayon three percent spandex so we got a lot going on here um, I don't know if they run small or if I'm just used to stretchier jeans. Size 26s, I couldn't get them to button. I could have if I wanted to suffocate myself, but I don't want to. So maybe if you aren't as heavy in the waist, they would fit because they fit fine in the butt and the legs. And if you are looking for a cute pair of denim shorts, I would definitely still go give them a try. And then I wanted to try a maxi skirt for you guys. I saw this one, I thought it was really cute with the tie dye. It has pockets, it has slits on the side, it's so soft. I tried it in a 4X, it's $9.97, which is really good for a skirt. 90% polyester, 10% spandex, so it has a very good little stretch to it. I decided just to wear it on my natural waist to show you with a t-shirt because I know some people don't like to wear it up higher like I do. I just decided to go ahead and show you guys how you could wear it as a dress, just pull it up. And I just showed you how you could tie it on both sides to just kind of give it a little something extra, make it a little shorter, and then untie just one side and wear it like that. I personally love it the best, which is one side tied. You kind of get like that asymmetrical look which I think is really cute and with my little headband from my toward video this is just like a patriotic queen right here it's so fun I personally would actually prefer to wear it like I did as a dress for this one in particular and here I am coming at you with another pajama top I love wearing pajama tops as regular top because a lot of times I feel like they just look like a regular top like hello this is just a really cute thermal and look at these cute button details with the little stars I just thought that was really cute this is a 3x but again it's the 2224 3x so a little bit smaller than the 3x in the actual clothing section 
$10.76, which is not bad for especially like a thermal top. It's 49% cotton, 47% polyester, and 4% spandex. So it has a nice stretch. As you can see, it's a little bit on the short side for me. Um, I don't mind it like at that length. It's kind of like borderline too short. It's definitely more fitted, but I think it looks really cute with all of the neutral browns and the leopard print headband and the converse. I just felt really cute in this. Now, the next thing I tried was this adorable button up linen top. I thought it was so cute because I'm kind of a sucker when it has the little ties at the bottom it just kind of gives me that like 1970s vibe you know I'm feeling like I should be in now and then I try it in a 4x $12.96 I love how long it was it fit beautifully I didn't have to worry about any like buttons popping everything about that was perfect 54% linen 46% cotton so it definitely has more of a linen feel though I would say very breathable very comfortable I just wore it with some jeans <laughs> with my brown mules I just thought this outfit is kind of like an elevated classy look for more casual the pop of yellow because I thought this really pretty it's kind of like a raspberry color it's really really pretty so I I thought that looked nice with the yellow i just want to show you guys a more dressy way so i decided to tuck and blouse it into a skirt that i had and some cute little lace-up heels that i had i just thought the whole look was really cute it's a perfect example of taking a top like this from day to night so you can get a lot of use like if you're going on vacation how perfect you're gonna like go to the beach or the amusement park during the day and then at night maybe throw on the skirt for a more evening attire and if you couldn't tell i'm kind of living for that leopard print headband so i decided to wear it also with this top which I think it's so cute it has the ruffle at the sleeve it has the ruffles here at the bottom which like the tiered ruffle I just think it's so cute this color is beautiful I tried it in a 3x $12.96 rayon and 4% spandex I think it looks really cute just with the jeans and the more casual look there super soft and comfortable top actually very breathable but it has all of those cute ruffle details that makes it look a lot more expensive this is definitely something you would see at even like Macy's or Nordstrom's but for a much higher price tag so I love that about it tiered ruffles kind of inspired me to try this out and I actually really love how it turned out I actually just took this flowy cotton skirt that I have and I I placed it so it looked like the third layer to make it look like it was just a blocked dress and I thought it actually looked really cute and I just paired it with some wedges to give it a little more dress up flavor and of course I had to keep the cheetah print headband because I actually thought it still looked so cute because then you had like a little bit of the black in there to kind of pull the black from the skirt I actually loved it almost as a dress the best but no i love it as a top too like talk about really making this piece work for you the next item i tried was this dress i tried it in a 4x it's 1997 which is not bad for a dress it has pockets it is 96 percent polyester and four percent spandex and the straps are removable so you could wear it strapless if you want or with the straps which is a nice detail i thought i love the colors and this was fun with the striping and then it has the flouncy little top so this dress definitely has a lot of style points to it but when i just went ahead and wore it with my strap up high heels i just thought that looked really cute and it definitely dressed it up but i decided just to keep it on its own i didn't want to hide this dress at all i feel like it was very beautiful and also i think it could work great for the actual beach just put a big summer floppy hat and you're ready to go now this next top really caught my eye literally because because hello this is our last top though you guys I'm sad this was such a fun haul but look at this color it's so beautiful the neon is just absolutely gorgeous I tried it in 3x and it's $14.97 it is 60% cotton and 40% polyester so it's really soft I love the stripes I loved the ruffle here at the arm everything about it the v-neck like there's just a lot of cute style details to this one and I just want to show you guys how you could easily make it different look just by simply switching out your accessories so I first just wore it with a pair of jeans and my Nike slides and that was just a super casual way to wear it but then to make it still kind of casual but just like a little more elevated I put in my mules and I put on a headband that has the same color in it and I just thought that that gave it another look both looks are still cute just kind of depends on what level of casual you want to go with and kind of just showing you how styling can change up how the shirt looks I think it definitely looks more expensive in the second way I think it looks good both ways just kind of up to you and overall the fit of the shirt I thought was good it was long enough it was definitely more on the fitted side unfortunately they didn't have a bigger size for me to try on but I still thought it looked really cute in um, the color obviously I love it <laughs> So that was everything and that wasn't even everything that there was at Walmart. There was a lot of other great pieces that, you know, I just couldn't show all right now or they just didn't even have my size at all. 
So I highly recommend if you haven't went to Walmart in a while or even if you have went recently, I would go and check any of these great pieces out. I really love them all. I have to say that magenta top was probably one of my favorite pieces just because of how pretty it looked, how elevated it was, and how obviously it could be worn in a lot of different ways. But I'm also a big huge sucker for the pajamas so I really do love the Harry Potter pajama sets. But I was also very surprised, very happily surprised for that two fur top. I just thought the vest looked so good on and the actual shirt itself looked so good. I'm really impressed with everything from Walmart as always. I love Walmart and I'm just like, I'm so happy that they really like stepped it up and made their stuff a lot more trendy, a lot more fashionable. But leave in the comments below whatever you guys loved and if you have any of these pieces, are we twinning? Are we going to be twinning? Let me know. Thank you guys as always so much for watching. Please like this video if you enjoy it, if you'd like to see more Walmart videos in the future so I don't go so far in between my Walmart videos please like this video and comment that you want more of them thank you guys so much and remember to just be you bye oh honey I'll do anything for you just tell me what you want me to hey yo whoa, I'm on a roll anyone else have that song still stuck in their head after watching Black Mirror do you ever feel like a misfit? Everything inside you is stuck and twisted. Oh, but it's okay to be different. Cause baby, so am I, so am I, so am I. She's got an amazing voice. Big blonde and beautiful. <laughs> so last video's movie quote was from When Harry Met Sally. And not a lot of you got this one, so that was a little bit harder, so yay for that. It's really a good movie. If you haven't seen it, I highly encourage you to check it out. So this video's movie quote is big mistake. Big, huge. I have to go shopping now. Comment below if you know what movie that quote is from without using Google. Peace.